Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, and in today's video, I'm going to tell you guys all about the natural hair extensions I got. So the name of the company is Kinky Curly Yaki, and they have a lot of stuff going on, guys. They sell closures, full bundles, half bundles, clip-ins, they have a lot of stuff going on. So they basically come in six different textures. They have light yaki, which is basically straight natural hair, coarse yaki, which is also straight hair, but with a little bit more curls and waves. They have kinky blowout, which is basically straight blown out hair, kinky curly, which is similar to 3C hair in texture, afro kinky curly, which is similar to 4A hair in texture, and afro coily, which is similar to 4B and 4C hair. So when you first get the hair, you're going to want to wash it and condition it before adding it to your hair. It comes with a list of instructions how to take care of it, how to wash it and stuff. So the first thing you do is just get a pan and container just filling up with some warm water And then I'm gonna take the entire pack of hair and just drop it into the water Make sure it's really getting in there make sure it's getting a lot of moisture just before you add any other product So I'm just gonna soak it up in there for about five minutes And I'm gonna add my shampoo and I'm using this hydrating soap shampoo from Eau Naturale And then I'm gonna use this coconut sheer um, leave-in conditioner Don't you worry about a damn thing if you want, you can take this shampoo and just put it all over the pan, but I decided to put it in my hand. So I just did that right now. I'm adding a little bit on my palm, and I'm going to just massage it all throughout the hair. And then I'm going to do this for about 10 minutes, and then I'm just going to damp it again and just rinse it thoroughly. somebody say no weapon. No weapon. So I'm going to do the same thing with the conditioner, add a little bit to my hand, massage it throughout the hair, and I'm going to actually take a comb this time and comb it with a big comb, and then I'm going to like rinse it through. So um, when I'm done with this, I'm going to twist it and just leave it hanging for a day or two. And when I went to apply it to my hair, it wasn't the exact texture. So with this hair, you kind of have to play with it and play with it until it matches your own. I mean, if your hair is exactly that texture, then that's great. But um, this is Afro Coily, and this is the last texture they had. And my hair is a little, my curls are a little bit more closely together. They're a little bit more closer together, and these are loose. So I had to play with it, keep twisting it, adding hair product to it to make it very like similar to mine and actually match my hair texture. So I just had to play with it and those are the twists you're looking at right now. I just, when I finished washing, I just twisted them up and the next day I just took them out and added some moisturizer, curl souffle, I just kept playing with it and combing it through, brushing it to make it match my hair texture. So about three, four times it actually matched it and I'm going to show you guys how I install it right now. So my hair is in perm rods right now and all I'm doing is just taking those out and taking out my hair and when I was playing around with the extensions I did my hair and I also did the extensions so the same product that I added to my hair I added to the extensions and I added the perm rods to the extensions as well. I don't know if you guys remember in the beginning, but the curls were a lot more looser and bigger. But since I kept playing with it, it matches my hair now perfectly. So to install it, you have to take each weft individually. And each weft comes with these clips that you kind of open and close. I think two wefts had um, four clips and some have three, some have two, some even have one just to fit the smaller places. So this is what I'm doing right now. And I'm taking this big weft that has four pieces. It has four clips, so it's really easy to install. All you have to do is just part your hair however you choose to, and you just open the clip and put it in and close it up. So that's what I'm doing right now. I'm just adding it to the line wherever I want it to be, and I'm just going to close it up. Just smile for a nigga. Everything will be all right. I seen a bigger picture. Obviously, if you're already satisfied with the hair texture, then you could leave it that way. But I wanted an even closer, perfect match. So I'm adding even more product and I'm doing a twist out. So I added more leave in conditioner and I'm adding a moisturizing souffle and I'm adding a curling custard and I'm just adding all these things to just do a twist out and adding all these products to make my natural hair and the extensions just mesh in together. So I'm just adding that and I'm adding it all over the hair and then I'm just gonna like separate it into three sections and I'm gonna twist those and add the perm rods at the end Don't you worry at all. 
if you wanted you could layer up the extensions so just add like one in the bottom add two at the top however you choose to but I just wanted to add about four or five extensions so I'm just gonna add another web just on top of the one I just added and I'm just gonna make the bottom of my hair the bottom and the middle just look a little bit fuller no weapon no weapon form no weapon no weapon form no weapon no weapon Since you can come with a million guns a million niggas behind dumb I ain't budging with the hair that's left over in the front of my head, I'm going to take this web that only has two clips and I'm going to add it right in the middle and I'm going to twist that up and then with the hair that's in the very front, I'm going to twist it up and just add a perm rod right in front of it. I didn't use all the extensions so I still have like a lot left over. I have about two, three or four clips that are like the single weft clips and I also have this one that has about two to three clips so yeah you can really make your hair full depending on how you're feeling I just wasn't feeling like adding all that extra hair today so yeah I'm just ready to go to sleep now and I'm gonna put a bonnet on to keep that moisture in and I'm gonna let you guys see how it looks the next day so now it's time to take them down and all I'm gonna do is just roll it in the opposite direction that I twisted it in. So I'm just gonna take out the other end of the perm rod and I'm just gonna twist it the opposite way just so I can preserve all the curls and stuff. So as you can see it looks very much like my hair like even when I was twisting I was like whoa like this looks just like my hair. I had trouble telling what was mine so that's pretty cool. You see extensions everywhere but you never really see hair that looks just like yours so that was pretty cool. It's a cool thing to have. I'm not going to style it much because I wasn't going anywhere. All I'm going to do is add some edge control and some bobby pins and just pin it back. But that's what's really cool about this is that since it looks just like your hair, you can do whatever you want with it. Do whatever you would regularly do to your hair. So that's pretty awesome. So that's basically all I have for today. I'm going to leave a link down below for you to go to the website and check it out. And also a coupon code if you're interested in purchasing. And yeah, thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe and, and give this video a big thumbs up. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.